the video shows how to create and package a new IP in Vivado tool. I have considered a JK flip flop as an example for the demonstration. Here is the JK flip flop Verilog HDL program with inputs J, K, clock, reset, and output Q, Q bar, followed by the high level programming. Now I want to convert this program into a IP. In short, it is called as intellectual property. To convert this code into an IP, go to the tools, click on create and package new IP. A new window pops out with some information. Click on next. This is a packaging option. Right now we are not going for the Axie peripheral. Select the package. Click on next. The package is stored at a particular location. IP location. Click on next. The creation of IP will have these informations like identification, family, files, ports, parameters, bus interfaces, addresses, like all this information will be embedded in the IP. Click on finish. Let me maximize this. These are the packaging steps that are followed to get a IP. These are the identifications on the right. You can use your company name or username followed by where the library is stored, name of the design, version. Whenever you want to modify anything, it can be upgraded to 2.0, 3.0 in that manner. Right now it is a basic form. It is 1.0. You can change if you want the name. I want to display it as JK flip flop. And if you want, you can have the display name. Lot of options are given here. Click on compatibility. Whatever the IP is created, it is compatible with all these versions of Xilinx. File groups followed by the parameters and ports. These are the input ports, which is a reset, clock, J, K, output Q, Q bar, along with their directions. Then go to the customization GUI. This GUI will help what is the design being created or the symbol with inputs and outputs. Then finally go to the click and review and package. Then select package IP. The tool will convert that into an IP. Click on OK. This is done. Now you can go to the sources. Close it. This program has been converted into an IP. I want to verify it. So click on create block design. You can keep the name same or change it. You can add the IP just by clicking on this add IP and search for JK. This is the IP which I have created. 
and this IP can be shared with anyone. You need to know the difference between an IP and a block. This is the code which we have written for a JK flip flop. This can be brought here, right? You can just right click and add module to the block design or simply right click add the module notice the differences between these two designs The module shows that it is implemented using RTL. Here the RTL level is shown. But in the IP, everything is hidden. It shows only the inputs and outputs. What type of a programming is carried out, it is not known to anyone. But here from the module, you can understand that it is implemented by using the RTL. So this IP will hide the or it encapsulates the data or implementation. So right now I have created the IP. Let me verify the design. So just right click and Click on make external. All the ports have been made. You can go to the sources, select this, on the port properties or setting. You can change the names to J and this one to K clock 0 will be changed as clock reset will be changed to so these are optional things and you can keep as this as well all the modifications are done then Click on regenerate layout followed by validate the design. Once the designing is done, convert this block design into Verilog. Right click, create HDL wrapper. Tool will convert this block design into Verilog. It is being converted into dot V. This IP can be shared with anyone without knowing the internal implementations. Once the creation is done, you can go and run the behavioral simulation of the design. Notice that the reset is given as a negative edge. So apply a 1. So that it changes to 0. Let me keep this reset on top. Apply a signal called clock 1 0 with a period of 100. Reset force constant make the value as 1 jk force clock with 1 0 let me change this period to 200 force clock 1 
zero, one hundred. And run for hundred nanoseconds. See the changes. So these are the values that are that are obtained for a JK flip flop. You can see this state wise. You can change this reset to zero. Then you won't have any output. 